Homero Mansi put a great deal into the short 44 years he was on this planet. He worked not just in music, but in film, journalism, teaching, trade unions, and politics during the time of Perón. Like Tango, Mansi was born of a Rio de la Plata, his mother Uruguay and his father Argentine, born in the far north, close to a railroad junction in the province of Santiago del Estero, while his father was eking out a living as a small farm owner. By the time he was seven, they'd moved to Buenos Aires, and he was attending school in the Pompeja district. Buenos Aires, at the turn of the century, was teeming with immigrants. Over three million foreigners had arrived in the port city between 1880 and 1910, settling into crowded tenements, or conventillos, which shared kitchen and patio spaces. They forged new ways in their new country, and the unique cultural phenomena of tango benefited from the fusion of Andalusian and Italian melodies, Cuban habaneras, and African candombes. Manzi became a part of this exciting explosion, the golden age of tango, which is roughly 1935 through 1950, a similar time frame as the Big Band era in the United States. Mansi wished to use film to help move from a colonial Argentina to a free Argentina. He wrote scripts for such films as La Guerra Gaucha, which celebrated the independence of Argentina. One of Mansi's favorite collaborators was Anibal Troilo, whom he wrote the incomparable tango Sur with. In simple language, without slang, he captures the nostalgia of the outskirts. Milena is another blockbuster, describing a soulful female tango singer like no other. Mansi also contributed to the snappier rhythms, writing some of the world's most famous milongas. His early death in 1951 to cancer grieved the tango community greatly, and the government named a street corner after him. The streets he wrote about in his tango sur. There's also a nightclub there on the same corner. Manzi's legacy is alive on this street corner, in his films, and in the lines of the beautiful poetic tango lyrics that you can hear today.